As you may be aware, a cat has recently shocked the chess world by destroying a lot of our top chess streamers. Oh no. This cat is called Medans, and very few is known about who it truly is. All we know is that his chess.com rating is 1. He plays at a strength close to Stockfish. He's very aggressive. He has a sharp sense of humor. Eventually crumble under my mighty paws. I mean meow. He he he. Okay, they've given this cat some uh, a good sense of humor. I'll, gi I'll give them that. And he made Gotham chess by it's disgust. He made me. <laughs> Twice. Well, if I go here, it's a fork. If I go here, it's a f it's another fork. So I guess the only safe move is this. I didn't even see that. Ooh. Not that the G is particularly good at chess, but still quite an achievement for a cat. It was shown that this cat, who was looked at as a god, as an Egyptian deity, could be defeated if matched against Stockfish. Stockfish at this point proceeds to make an absolute mockery out of this bot, and I, I mean, just watch. So one might wonder, how does he play thousands of games simultaneously with his paws? Is he really living in an alternate universe? This, we don't care. But one question remains, who is behind the camera? I'm Valosh Gaming, welcome to my channel. Today, I'm bringing you a story that will shock and amaze you. It's the story of Middens, seemingly ordinary cat, who I recently discovered is a human in disguise. That's right, Middens is Hans Niemann, and this video proves it. Let's first look at his name, Middens. If you compare with Hans Niemann, you will find all the letters, except, that's right, TT. Sounds familiar? Yes, exactly. It stands for Tidal Tuesday, the biggest chess tournament held on chess.com every week. That's right, the exact same website from which Hans Niemann was banned after he got accused of cheating by Magnus Carlsen. If that's not enough proof to you, let's look at his playstyle. When playing against him, you feel like you're playing against the bot. Guess what? That's exactly what people say about playing against Hans. Middens is not as good as Stockfish, but apart from a few inaccuracies, he's playing the top move most of the time. Similarly, Hans Niemann is known for having very high accuracy games, close to Stockfish, while still making rare mistakes here and there. About his playstyle, you can see he's also very aggressive. He plays the Tarash defense, which is a very aggressive version of the Queen's Gambit declined. He likes to play sharp positions and go for it. Remind you of someone? Yes, you're right. Hans Niemann. Now let's talk about his temperament. Medans is very cheeky. Doesn't hesitate to taunt his opponent by saying he's better than them and that they're trapped in his jungle. The light that burns twice as bright burns half as long. You are not long for this game. What? Bro, is... Hans Niemann is known for his brutal chess talk and being what they call a Jiggy Chad. This video, after a win against the world champion, speaks for itself. Hans, yesterday was a terrible uh, day for you and today you start out with a masterpiece. How would you summarize it? Chess speaks for itself. Is it something special doing this against Magnus Sons? Not convinced yet? Well, let's see what people say of Middens. First, let's look at Hikaru Nakamura, the famous American chess streamer. After struggling for hundreds of moves against Middens, he finally got a draw and surprisingly said he was not impressed by Middens' playstyle. Not so impressed, actually. Can't even beat a cat. Yeah, I'm not impressed. I'm not impressed. Sounds familiar? Yes, that's right. Hans Demon is also very tough to beat. Yet Hikaru said that he was not impressed by his play. Namely, 
that his analysis was not that of a 2700. So like this analysis is not 2700 level yeah, analysis. Sacrifice material. This is not 2700 so level analysis. Now, let's look at what Magnus Carlsen thinks of Mittens. He said he doesn't want to play against him. Yeah, I'm not gonna play Mitten. Mittens. Sounds familiar? Yes, that's right. He also refused to play against Hans Niemann in recent times, withdrawing from a tournament after playing Hans and later resigning a game on move 2 against him. Magnus has to resign the game wow. against Hans Niemann. Yes. Magnus said that he doesn't like Mittens and he doesn't like Formula 1. What else doesn't he like? Yes, that's right, Hans Niemann. Also, Magnus said, Middens is just another soulless bot. But it's still a bot. It's still a very, very ordinary, soulless, non-animalistic bot. Not far from his accusations of Hans Niemann cheating at chess, where he said Hans looked very at ease at the board in tough positions, as if he had lost his soul. We know this all sounds crazy, but the evidence is undeniable. Middens is Hans Niemann. But the story doesn't end there, because if you need yet another proof, look at how Middens is described by Chess.com. Middens likes chess, but how good is she? And the she is important. You must know that Chess.com got sued by Hans Niemann for defamation, amongst other things. That's why Chess.com tried to cover up the tracks and lead us to believe Middens was a female. They don't want another trial, especially since they pictured Middens as a poor, helpless cat, which is offending to a player of the caliber of Hans. Finally, they also gave Middens a rating of 1, clearly indicating he's a cheater of some sort, as he's playing way above his rating. They also accused Hans Niemann of cheating. If you look at when Middens loses a game, he accuses his opponent of cheating, as if he couldn't believe that someone would be able to beat him. What? How? You ch Oh, is it, is it accusing me of cheating? Maybe I should sue him. He's clearly enraged, just like Hans Niemann when he loses. What? How? Oh, how is he so smart? If you're still in doubt about who Middens is, well, doubt no more. You want a final last proof? If you say Hans Niemann repeatedly fast, what do you get? Try it for yourself. Hans Niemann, 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 Hans Niemann. That's right. Hans Niemann becomes Middens. That's all for today. As always, stay tuned as we continue to uncover the truth about this mysterious feline. Thank you and subscribe now.